Hi guys, welcome back. Uh, welcome to episode 11. No, it is not nighttime. It is early in the morning of 7 o'clock because, you know, early bird gets the worm. And uh, I just wanted to see, like, how much light is uh, really out here and stuff. And I need to put more lights around here, especially in this area so I can see my equipment more. But, um, yeah, it's November 3rd, game time. And... I don't see where I parked my vehicle. Uh, what we're going to work on is that we're going to get rid of this. We need to upgrade our, tra our wood trailer. Um, we're going to get rid of this today. Um, because we're going to do more upgrades to the uh, the yard here. Our uh, canola here is growing. And I think... Uh, January? No, June. It was June that it was going to be ready for harvest. But as soon as they get harvest, we're going to take this little... Well, when the sun comes out more, uh, we're going to do a lot more things. <clears throat> get that entire thing level. But I wanted to come over here to my chickens. And, uh, you know, that, that one holds 120 and this one holds 40. And the bees are doing their job, you know, but they're just sleeping... You know, there's there are them over here as well, so they're just sleeping. So that's uh that's great. They have a hundred meters. I didn't I didn't know that. Oh, that's great. Hundred meters. That's that's pretty far. They will be uh, reaching this uh, field here with no problem. So, but uh, I think I'm gonna move the pallet tree here a bit and move. I think kind of get rid of these bees here a bit uh, and put something like I guess like grass around this area I think that would be best yeah I think that would be best and it's like, like that um, is this light on yeah that lights on yeah, let's see is that, these lights on yeah that's all lights on too so yeah we're gonna um, we're gonna get more chickens here what are, who are we at here we're at 10 pieces of eggs yeah I think we can do better so let me just order some more chickens here i know i've been ordering a lot and ordering a lot and we're already pushing at 24 out of 40. i just i don't know what else to do about these chickens man like i think i'm feeding them wrong or something but i'm gonna get there and then i want to see about these ones probably do more in this one this one seems to be more ready yeah so there's like uh there's 10 and 10 of each um I guess they haven't fully, I mean, they're at maximum health. And if we go to our app about these things, here we go. Uh, yeah, so they're completely healthy. 100% healthy. Um, it's just, we just got to get the food up for their protein food, base food, and more snacks food. So we got to max these out as much as possible. Uh, but to do that, we will have to order more chicken so they can eat the uh, food more. So we're going to do... I think we're gonna go up to we'll do 40 that should be enough 40 should be enough 40 chickens right there to kind of get it going so space enter there we go so now they'll be able to eat the chickens the chickens will be able to eat more of those uh go back to that eat more of the total capacity of the food faster so i can fill up the proteins up more faster so it doesn't look like it, but nope, they're they're in there. It looks like they're in there. Are they in there? Yeah, they're just at zero health and everything. So yeah, they'll I guess they'll be there in a second. Oh, there's the truck. Um, so let's go check of our uh, greenhouse that we started up. See how that goes, and then. There is still more that we can add um, here as well. I was going to cut the grass and make balers, but that is not turning out right for some odd reason. So we'll just uh, continue growing our uh, our land here as much as possible, keeping on to the edges. Uh, still got to get rid of that wood, which is fine. But yeah, there's a lot of things that we can do. Um, I'm just going to only have one of these uh, greenhouses for now, because if we go in, 
like to explore my lance too. If we go in, um, we need a lot of uh, ingredients. Um, but remember, I told you that the greenhouses are linked together plus the house, and we got a water fountain. So now I can do is uh, turn on the sprinkler heads for these things. So it's going to be constantly doing so. So I'm going to do that. Um, I'm going to activate the system that was put in for us long ago. Uh, reason why I didn't activate it because you know it does bring in a, like a, like it'll fill this up in like in two seconds, kind of way or like a couple of minutes. So um, they're con I don't got to bring water around anymore. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna hit yes because uh, this is an automatic system, and we're gonna take a nice good chunk of our money. Now we're gonna worry about transporting water to our. Uh, we do need to herbicide. We need to bring in uh, seed and uh, fertilizer as well. So time to. Call shop and sell our water jug and our uh, trailer and get more of a universal where we can do multiple things with it. And then I think that's all I think I'm here. I'm pretty sure, but I'm not that sure. That uh, as I was cutting the trees down for the shop um, down at the uh, the wish and all that, I think. Are we passing? Oh, I guess. No, it should be around here. Where is it? Where is it? Uh. The more I go back, the more I don't see it, but I made a landmarker where uh, it was left concrete, left over everything, and I decided to uh, to get rid of it. Huh. I guess I don't have it anymore? I know back here. Like, I'm not, I'm not crazy. Well, crazy-ish. I don't even know here anymore. Okay, probably right here should be it. Look at the map. She should... back. No. Yeah, this looks wrong. I am literally jumping up and down for all this. And uh, I don't see it. Oh. Wow. It's right here. Here's the, here's the edge of the pepper. So um, I think I'm going to do is push all the... I think I'm going to put the machete back here. And uh, I'm contact the contractor. Again. Uh, so yeah, I think I'm going to move my house back here. And everything. And the concrete that's up in front is the same. But we're just going to smooth it out. And trying to figure out a nice good road. Back here. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to... Uh, so my current I'll put right here. We need a bigger barn to store our equipment because we're getting a lot in here. And then just uh yeah, you know a lot of it. So stay tuned. This is good. I just gotta call everything and uh get everything in. So it's gonna be a lot. So hopefully it doesn't take so long. All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, as you can tell, it is November 10th. Uh, I ended up uh, calling the contractor. He was able to help. And uh, I can see we're at $8,000 and a little over. And what happened was over these days, there was really not much going on. Um, I had to wait because what I did was, and as you can notice that my shed's gone, and there's a new one over there. So shed is gone. As you can see, it is completely gone. There's nothing there anymore. Absolutely nothing. All of this gear, plus over here, um, it's going to be all transfer over here, um, except for the house. The house cannot be transferred yet. Ooh. Okay, well, I guess this Fast and Fear is here, or, is, or, or something's there. I don't know. Uh... You hear somebody drift like that? That is crazy. But anyways, uh, everything um, is going to be in here. Everything. Um, 
all my equipment, everything to storage here. I uh, couldn't, uh, couldn't decide to put a house up here, so I'm just going to keep it down there, but that's fine. Um, as you can see, there's like more wood piling up. i still got the previous one, so we're going to have to clear that ourselves on there. I couldn't really do anything um, about it because the contractor said that he was going to take it, and then he didn't. So I don't, I don't know. Uh, I'm most likely just gonna buy a, 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 a wood chipper and just throw it in there because it's really pointless of just me hauling that thing around. Uh, we did get more chickens in, uh, you know, because we bought 40. And then our garden back there. If we look to our our um, app here, I love this thing. Uh, I end up buying like more seeds and herbicides, so. We can probably get this thing going again, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to get this all going again, so we can have a little bit more money coming through. I didn't do it. Um, I forgot to activate it when I was putting supplies in, but we still got more supplies to put in and more fertilizer and stuff like that. So, but yeah, and then as you can see, we have uh, honey here to get rid of. But again, I'm going to have to. Uh, I don't know, can I pick them up just by myself? I keep forgetting. Um, no, no, I can't. I don't know why it glitched, but no, there's way over. Yeah, way over. So, um, but I can get them individually though. Mm. I don't know. I'll probably do that some other time until it's full. That'd be best. We're at 15 eggs on here. That's good. And over here, we got nothing because they're very new. So that's that's okay. That's okay. So they had pretty much nothing else to do on the farm other than just move the equipment from one spot of the place to another. And then uh, eventually when all of this garden here you know all of the cornell here it, once we harvest it whatever we're gonna fix the land so it's a little bit more straight you know a little bit more flat and then we're gonna start just plowing everything just plowing everything getting the um road into it so it's gonna look like a giant construction site for a second uh still looking for someone to pick up this uh wood carrier here because i have no no uh, use for it whatsoever so but I'm gonna load up uh, quite a lot from here trying to get everything going just like that so it's gonna it's gonna take a while uh, for me to do so um, but yeah I just wanted to you know show you guys my new shed I got rid of the other one and uh, it's gonna it's gonna be great it's just gonna be a little bit more things that's Tree still off the property, so after a while there is going to be a, uh, a fence uh, at one point to block off my land because um, I do want to have a fence to kind of help me better guide things. So, but yeah, look at this thing. This thing is is all right for the time being. Um, little clipping because you know it's pretty massive. So system is trying to be nice and. Um, do with the graphics so I'm just going to take this thing slow but um, I'm going to do a little cutscene here so, and you'll see everything in its rightful place and then you'll uh, you'll see the wood probably pile up onto the, the wood um, trailer there but I don't know well uh, I don't, I don't know where I'm going to start though, but I mean, they're both going to be up for sale. And so hopefully, I don't know, one or the other will happen. But anyways, I will see you guys in a few hours because it's only 8.15. So maybe, hopefully I can get done moving on the stuff by, by 10 o'clock. We'll see. All right, guys, and we're back. Um... Sold the trailer uh, for uh, almost close to $3,000. That's what the green thing was because the gentleman just left to pick up the uh, trailer. Uh, he did take the wood and uh, it took him a while, you know, for all this to get done. So I, I do apologize. But uh, from the wood that he took, uh, we ended up getting 
uh, $22,791. Um, but uh, I have all this um, scrap wood here. Um, so yeah, not uh, not too much. Um, I told him I had more wood on the side here of the field, but he was like, nah, I'm good. And I was like, all right, no, well, if you need more wood, whatever, I'm here. So uh, he said, all right. He was a, a local, um, you know, just passing through the area here to see if there was anybody else. And I was like, all right. So uh, we don't have a trailer at all to haul wood, so we need to buy one when we do so. But I'm kind of picking now my trailers. But look how great this is. Like my shed is all up with all the equipment. We're starting to look like more of a farm here. Um, eventually, we are going to continue off if I run down here pretty quick. A little short bursts. Yeah, I, I kind of run like not that good, but. Um, as you can see, this is kind of like a bit off. Uh, we are going to be moving the chicken farm a bit because I don't, I don't like this here. It has a hill. This is like a safety hazard, for my opinion. But once we um, get our first harvest in to see how that goes, then everything's coming up and then doing the fence all the way around. I I will completely do that. Uh, as you can see, I had one equipment left back here to, uh, give, uh, to put in the shed, but... Uh, I don't think it's going to fit. Uh, something I am going to keep down here for now is the pressure washer in the repair shop. And then I still want to, uh, I'm still going to leave all this stuff here uh, and things like that in terms of everything. But I mean, it's been so much, so a lot um, that it is, it's just crazy. So uh, there's a lot of things that done in these uh, three hours, but um Episode 11 and 12 are going to cover for November 10th uh, of the month because we still got more work, but I'm going to leave it off here on this video for now. I don't want to make it too big, but yeah, you guys have a wonderful day. Uh, if you're a viewer or whatever, you're not subscribed, please subscribe. I mean, there's a lot going on. Um, as you see, we're moving a little bit forward. This is what farmers do on a daily basis. They find something around the farm to keep themselves busy. And if they're new, like myself, to the farming, it takes a while. So...